Welcome, yes, to the most delightful Supercard YouTube channel. If you are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, turn on the notifications as well, and drop a big thumbs up on this video right now. That would be delightful. And if you guys don't subscribe to the channel, you guys will be deleted! Sorry about that. That was not very delightful. Now make sure you guys stick around because today's Supercard video is going to be delightful. Yes. So let's start this video off on my girlfriend's account where she has enough tickets to open a challenge reward pack. Yes. And it is going to be delightful, yes. Will she get a monster card? Let's find out right now, yes. She gets an ultimate charisma, and she gets an ultimate card. And it is my arch enemy, Bray Wyatt. Wait a minute, I'm not Matt Hardy. Bray Wyatt is Matt Hardy's enemy. Not Mayan, but he is still a crappy card because he's ultimate. Delete! 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 Oh, what time is it? Oh, crap. I have to get up. I have to record a super card video. I was having the weirdest dream that I was broken. That was so weird. Do you guys ever have weird dreams like that where you feel like you're a completely different person? That was super strange, but anyways guys, I do have to complete more of my daily challenges, so I could open up a challenge reward pack for you guys here on my account. So one of my challenges is just to pro a card, so that's super easy. I have these two Booker T's right here, so I'm going to pro them up. Here we go, and I'll get a ticket for that. I got a golden ticket. I got a golden ticket. Alright, so I only need to complete one more challenge to be able to open up that challenge reward pack for you guys. And I'm going to complete this event perfection, which is going undefeated in a Money in the Bank game. And once I complete that, I'll also complete the completionist challenge, um, which will give me three tickets. So that will be just enough tickets that I need to open up that challenge reward pack for you guys. I also do have a platinum pack opening that I will be doing in just a little bit here, guys. So make sure you guys do stay tuned so you don't miss out on it. I will be getting another beast card. Will it be a pro? Make sure to stick around so you guys find out what beast card I get and if it's a pro. Uh, but anyways, guys, here we go. I did set my uh, Money in the Bank deck up with all SummerSlam 17 cards. Um, just single cards, that is, because it makes the matches a lot easier. I get matched up with mainly Ultimate Pro cards, which is really awesome. It's easy wins every single time. All right, so we're going with Brian Kendrick here. First game, easy win. Okay, and I don't have too many contracts saved up. As of right now, that Finn Balor cash-in really killed me, but he was definitely worth it. He's an awesome card. Um, anyways, let's go with Matt Hardy next. Oh, yeah. And let's face John Cena. And how do you guys feel about Matt Hardy finally being broken or woken? Whatever you want to call it. How do you guys feel about that? Do you guys like his gimmick? Or do you guys like just the regular Matt Hardy that we're all used to? Um, okay, anyways, let's go with... Carl Anderson next here, and let's face, uh, Elias Sampson, I guess, because, uh, you know, Elias Sampson is a pretty crap card, and hopefully Carl Anderson wins. He should. He's a pretty decent card, so I should win this one here. Yes, I did win, so very awesome stuff, okay, and then we're gonna go with Bray Wyatt next, and we're gonna face Tyler Bate. Hopefully I win this one. I have to go undefeated all the way to the top. That means I can't lose one match, so... Hopefully he does it. Yes, he does. Good job, Ray Wyatt, for that. And then Seth freaking Rollins will end the match. Okay, I should win this one because Seth Rollins is a very good SummerSlam 17 card. So, should be good here. And yes, I am. I did it, guys. I got enough tickets to finally open up that Challenge Reward Pack. I definitely can't wait to open up the Platinum Pack and see what I get from that. It's going to be super awesome, guys. There we go. I should start playing Money in the Bank more to start saving up on contracts. Um, so I could go for another really awesome cash in in the future. But anyways, let's claim up these tickets here, guys. And here we go. I officially have enough tickets for that pack. Let's get ready to open it. 
Uh, will I get a monster card? I'm really hoping for a monster card. Even a beast card would be nice. Um, you know, I never get anything good out of these packs. But hopefully this time, my luck will be different. Will I get a monster or beast card? Fingers crossed. Let's find out, guys. Come on, give me that beast or monster card. Even a beast card, I'll be happy. I'll be happy with that. Give me it. No, an elite power, and they always seem to give me an ultimate card. I don't know what it is with these packs, but they always seem to give me an ultimate superstar. And that's really dang annoying, guys. Who is it? It's the Miz. I came to play. But anyways, guys, that was a really crap pack opening. Wait a second. Wait just a second. I also forgot I will be getting a monster card in this video, too, because I almost have enough battle points saved up to be able to buy a monster single from the battle point store and once i open up this platinum pack that will give me just enough points to be able to buy that monster single from the bp store so will i get a pro probably not but i definitely can't wait to see what monster card i get all right guys so it looks like braun Strowman is this week's solo ring domination event card holy cow this is a nice looking card I really wish I could get my hands on this card, but unfortunately, I'm not a high enough tier to be able to go for it. Let me know if you guys will be going for this card down in the comment section below. I'm pretty sure a lot of people won't be able to go for this card that watch my YouTube channel just because I know a lot of people are lower tiers. Um, so don't feel bad. I won't be able to get this card myself, which is unfortunate because I am a fan of Braun Strowman. So I literally only have to finish one more challenge, and then I'll be done with all of my daily challenges. Uh, this one's Play 6 Wild Games. I already did 5 out of 6, so I just have to play literally one more, and then all of my daily challenges will be finished. Let's see if I can actually get this glitch to work, where I put mainly all uncommon cards in my deck, and then I auto-fill back to my best deck, and then, you know, I usually get matched up with easier, like, really easy people. Um, so let's do that right now. Let's fill this up with all uncommon cards. And uh, see if this works when I auto-fill back. Okay, so one more card here. And then I have to change my support cards up. Alright, good stuff. Just have to get these out of here. Okay, I don't have... Uh, Alright, I guess I could go with an epic. I just want weaker support cards in there. I don't want my WrestleMania 33s. So I'll go with two epics. Alright, that puts me in the rare tier, so that's good. That's what I want. Now let's auto-fill back. And let's see if I actually get matched up with somebody really easy. No, I did not. Uh, but I did get a WrestleMania 33 plus plus opponent. So I will take that. That's still going to be an easy win for me here. So I'll have no problem winning this. I should perfect game. No problem. But anyways, guys, here we go. I'm facing T-Dog. All right. So let's try to perfect game here. All right. Let's go with my sensational Sherry manager. We're going to go with Finn Balor because it's always Finn, guys. All right, against Sami Zayn. Easy win there. Good stuff. All right, we're going to go with The Undertaker next. Power and Toughness. Another easy win there. Yeah, I'll definitely perfect game. Definitely. All right, and then we're going to go with Tamina, Speed and Charisma. And, uh, yep, there we go, guys. Perfect game. My last challenge is officially completed, so that is good. I have all of my tickets for today. Alright, so we're back to the draft board. Could I get a good pull? Probably not. Oh, I get an Elite Xavier Woods. Alright. That's not too bad. That's a pretty decent pull there. Um, just from the draft board anyways. Alright, so good stuff. And uh, let's just claim up this ticket. And all of my challenges are finished. Alright guys, so the time is finally here to open up my Platinum Pack from Team Battleground. And also buy that monster single from the battle point store i am super excited guys for this this is great i have been saving up my battle points for quite some time for this very moment to be able to cash in for an awesome monster card but anyways guys let's view the mailbox let's see what i get i am guaranteed a beast card here i'm hoping it's a pro i would love to get my first ever beast pro so will i get a pro let's find out right now here we go this definitely better be a pro. I'm going to be so disappointed if this is not a pro. But here we go. Let's open it up. Oh, it's Curtis Axel. It is not a pro. Darn it. They're going to do what they did to me when I hit SummerSlam 17 tier. They did not give me the pro for the longest time. I just had so many SummerSlam 17 singles, but I didn't get a pro for a while. They're probably going to do this with me with the Beast tier, too. 
They're going to give me all these beast cards, but it's going to take forever to get a beast pro. I see how it is. I see how it is, super card. But I did get a beast Curtis Axel. I get a SummerSlam 17 Pete Dunn. That is not a pro for me because I don't have Pete Dunn. Um, and I get a WrestleMania 33, Rusev Mashka. Um, but I'm still excited though because I still have that monster that I am going to be opening up from the Battle Point store. So, Curtis Axel, pretty crappy beast card if I do say so myself. But let's actually head over to the BP store and let's claim up this monster single. So here we go. It is 15,000 battle points. So it is a little expensive, but it's definitely worth it. Here we go, guys. Who do you think I'm going to get? Let me know your predictions right now down in the comment section below on who you think my monster card is going to be. Give you a couple seconds here. And let's claim it up, guys. Who do I get? Who do I get? Oh, the Macho Man. Oh, yeah. Not a pro for me, but that is a really awesome monster card. But that is going to be it for this video, guys. I do want to thank you so much for watching. Remember, if you guys did enjoy it, to leave a big thumbs up on it. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And turn on the bell notification as well for more awesome super card videos just like this one. But I'm Newology. And until next time, I'm out for now. Peace.